Mobile app developers can now tap on a new tool to test their applications for security risks. It's one way the Cybersecurity Agency of Singapore is looking to prevent potentially malicious app installations. Authorities are also ramping up partnerships with the private sector to strengthen the country's cyber defences in its fight against scams. Ivy Chalk reports. Before clicking that download button, how do you check if an app is safe? Developers in Singapore now have a way to find out. A new portal lets them upload their mobile apps and scan for risks to get a safety rating and a report recommending ways to fix gaps. With fewer vulnerabilities, apps will be more resilient against malware and other attacks. This means that the apps you download will have stronger safeguards built in, protecting your data, your money and your peace of mind. Cybersecurity experts say that for the portal to stay effective, it must be constantly updated to keep up with evolving threats. They will have to keep updating it all the time, not just the threat model itself and what kind of areas of security they are covering, but also to make sure there are no new threats and new, not new attack vector that has been joined to the list. It's especially important now, as malware-enabled scams rose over 260% in the first half this year, compared to the same period in 2024, with losses totaling 5.5 million Singapore dollars. Beyond regulations, authorities are also calling on tech firms to do their part. Private sector entities must proactively detect and take down scams perpetrated on their platforms. Or better still, implement ex ante safeguards to prevent scams on their platforms in the first place. It's why Singapore is working more closely with industry players. For one, it has renewed partnerships and signed new deals with tech giants like Google to exchange knowledge and best practices. At the end of the day, what we want to do is to prevent user harm before that actually occurs. And especially when it comes to something like scams and frauds here, this is something which is uh, very crucial because we want to take the fight all the way upstream. It's hoped that these efforts will help build a safer online space for users.